the best product to protect your family from the sun, and that is very important. We all know to wear sunscreen, but now there are some new tools to help. That's right, and Lori Bergamato, the style director for Good Housekeeping Magazine, is here with some consumer lab sunovations. Is oh, that what yeah. we're calling them? So okay. I love a sunovation. I love a sunovation too. So tell us what's new out there in terms of sun protection. So we're going to first start talking about UPF, which is ultraviolet protection factor, and you'll find that in clothes. I mean, to bring out our first model, Tatiana. Now, this is a look you'll see on the beach. Everybody needs a rash guard. This one has a UPF of 50. And you guys, it's a little different than SPF, so I'll try to make the science easy. But essentially what it measures is the rays coming through the clothing. So with a UPF of 50, only 2% of UV rays are coming through, so you're really well protected. Now, we know this is a beach look, but we wanted to show you that you can be protected all the time, even at work. So if Sam will come on in. So this rash guard is from Land's End. It's a good housekeeping seal holder. And like I mentioned, UPF 50, because it's woven so tightly, it doesn't read bathing suit, and she can take it to work. Oh. So there you have it. Do they make they make clothes for women? They too? make it women, men's, and kids. All right, I'm covered so too. There you go. Now, wow. Michael and Amy, maybe you don't want to go out and buy a ton of UPF clothing. Well, I have a solution. This is called SunGuard. The wind has knocked it over. But what this does is you just put it in your laundry, mm -hmm. you do your wash up to 20 times, it's under five bucks, and it boosts the UPS oh, wow. of whatever you have. This dress that you have, although that looks like it's dry cleaning, that looks fancy. <laughs> like t-shirts, jeans, six, all of that? Anything, so a regular t-shirt has a UPF of five, just your average t-shirt. If you use this, it boosts it up to 30. Wow. wow. So there you go. Okay, okay so now we, we've carried, UP, we've talked about UPF, let's talk about monitoring your SPF. We all know to put it, but the reapplication can be tricky. Mm -hmm. So we're going to bring a familiar face in here. Mara. Mara. Here's Mara. 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 So we have three sun evasions, Amy, to talk to you about. The first one you can see on Mars bicep. That is the My UV patch. That's from La Roche-Posay. It's free with any sunscreen that you buy from them. And it attaches to an app and it allows you to know how much UV exposure you're getting. It stays on for three days, and as the patch gets darker, that's alerting you that you're getting too much sun exposure. Wow, but are you gonna and have a circle on your arm? No, oh. it goes on and off like a little Band-Aid. It's really easy. So no, no tan lines, no, no tan, tan lines. lines. Don't you worry about that. You put sunscreen on over it, too, okay. so it monitors. But for kids, so Miss Nina, hi, baby girl. Can we see your cool band here? So this is from Sunburn Alert, and this works with any sunscreen. And what you can do with this is as the, the more red it gets, it's an alert to parents, time to reapply wow. the sunscreen. And it works even for babies. Hi, Cruz. So you can see these diapers from Baby Gannix. These are little swim pants. This is what it looks like without UV exposure. And then with initial UV exposure, you can see this one here. The scene is starting to form. And if the little froggy gets really dark, it's prolonged UV exposure, pull that baby, pull out, baby of the sun. out of the sun. But what yeah. about your eyes? We all want to look cool in our shades, oh, but you know, what should we guys. know for protect our eyes from Thanks, the exposure? Mara. Thank, Thank you, Mara. Mara. Thank you. Thank you, baby. So for sunglasses, there are a few things you want to look for. 100% UVA, UVB protection. And what you'll see, we've lost our tags here, here we go. What you'll see, we got these at the drugstore, 100% UVA, UVB, those look good on you, Amy. Nice. And then we went to like, for the fashion H&M, you might see UV 400, you guys, that means you're well protected. Or if you go a little higher end, these are from electric, you'll get a little chart. So, you know, UV 400, 100% UVA, UVB protected. And the electric ones actually have melanin in them, which acts like SPF 140 for your eyes. So you want to keep those protected. One other quick thing to mention, polarized uh -huh. does not mean it protects you oh, from see, the sun. It I just reduces that. glare. I so totally you want to be that really that careful. You no, no, it does not. Oh, but speaking of, now that you're ready to go to the beach, okay. you need some good gear. So Michael, okay. do you know what's in there? Put that on, Michael. Let's see how you look with that little backpack. It's That's like a, a beach it's like umbrella. It's like a fanny pack, huh? Yeah, it's, it's a beach umbrella. Just throw really it over your shoulder. Pack. Now, guys, I want to show you. This is what <laughs> Michael's holding. This is called Leaf for Life. Oh, how cool. Oh. How nice is that? This is actually UPF 50, and you can see how easy it is and how compact. That's Michael has it so that it's all you know nice and compact. But Amy and Michael, Style. if you add this solar panel, you can charge your phone using Are the sun just sitting under there. And this attaches to your phone, and it's a little fan. So if you get hot, <laughs> I mean, what is that? Isn't this incredible. like this is a sun evasion if I ever saw one? Yes, my friends. it is. So I, you know, wish everybody a good Memorial Day weekend. Thank you for having me, and stay safe in the sun. Thank you, Lori.